Welcome to volume two, You Blew It. You Blew It, the feature effect, is actually multiple effects in one routine. I'm going to thumb through these cards, and whenever you'd like, just tell me to stop, all right? Anywhere you'd like, tell me to stop. Right there? All right. Let's see the card that you stopped me at. The Ace of Diamonds. I want you to write your name in large letters on the face of the Ace of Diamonds. Blue ink on a red backed penetrating card. ink. That should be long enough. <laughs> the card you wrote on, yeah, <laughs> it should have penetrated through and affected the back of the card. There is one card that's blue. Now remember, it's not permanent, so I'm not even going to touch it. I don't want to smear anything. Wow! Isn't that a cool piece if of magic? I want to do some other kinds of magic. Well, I'm glad that it's not permanent ink. Maybe I can rub it off the card. I know it's a souvenir for you, but just bear with me for a second. Watch real close. If you just rub lightly. There we go. Check it out. The signature is gone. We need to do one more bit of magic here. If you just rub, you might be able to capture, there we go, a little bit of the red. This. Because you actually see your signature materialize right back on the card and I want to make it completely different so we're going to take this red back card and just rub it across the marker and it will absorb some of the ink and that is you blew it hi this is my feature effect you blew it Here's how it starts. I Castle recently. I visited with Dean Dill and Alfonso. They like materialized from volume one, the color change, and they suggested an alternate ending more geared for magicians. I like the idea, and I worked out a hailing. So here it is an alternate ending for materialized. Your eyes. You know, if you cut through the deck in kind of a neat way, fantastic. But I'm thinking. The card actually materialized, watch very close, right before your eyes. That would be pure magic. The Ace of Spades. What's the Ace of Spades? Because it actually has the ability to morph into another card, the Ace of Diamonds. The Ace of Diamonds is a pretty darn magical card too, because you'll see it melt right into the Ace of Clubs. The last Ace will appear. That's pretty neat. The aces are gone. And that is some real magic with one, two, three, all four of our aces. Here's the idea. Four aces are here. You're going to add a cover card. If you want to, you can be stand there talking, and as this hand is down like this. After lecturing at Denny and Lee's in Las Vegas, I was asked the question, how do you get hired in restaurants? Restaurants are one venue that I perform in, so I put together some suggestions on how to get hired. How do you decide which type of establishments to approach to perform at? 